I'm Sarah Ryan, and I moved to Portland in the fall of 1997. I moved from Ann Arbor, Michigan to take a job at Multnomah County Library. Well, I've been writing fiction in journals kind of forever. Um, I started writing comics much more recently, and it had a lot to do with the amount of comics I was reading and thinking about, and I realized that I could tell different kinds of stories with comics than I could with prose, and that there were advantages to both, and so I decided that I wanted to be able to switch between straight prose and writing comics. I, believe, I think it was probably Scott McCloud who talks about the spaces between the panels, and so what you can do with the passage of time using the way comics panels are laid out, where you can draw it out, where you can have it be extremely compressed moment to moment. And the other thing that I really, really like about comics is that you can have the picture telling you something, the text telling you something else, and you have to look at both and interpret them both to be able to really understand what's going on. Someone back in Ann Arbor days told me, as soon as she knew that I was coming to do the interviews for the library job, um, said, oh, yeah, yeah, Portland would be good for you. You'd fit right in. And I thought, what do you mean? <laughs> but I think there is something casual, something that is accepting of being smart. Um, you know, I, I am a grown-up, and I don't really have to dress like a grown-up at work. I appreciate that. Um, I appreciate, although it's sometimes frustrating the earnestness with which people sort of approach problems. Um, there's just a lot of openness in general to ideas and ways of living. Um, there's lots of the live work spaces. Um, and it's funny, sometimes I feel like I'm the only person in Portland who doesn't love to garden. Um, you know, it's nice to see everybody else's wonderful gardens. Um, so there's just a lot that makes it a very comfortable city. I like that it's okay to sort of be wonky in Portland. There are definitely a lot of sort of wonky people that, wonky and geeky people, and that seems to be good. It's really just lovely to me that there are so many people who are part of a community, and I really do see it as a community um, of comics and writing that is very supportive. Um, I don't really see a lot of people who are mean and not interested in each other being successful. So one of the things that I really appreciate, you know, when I've been traveling and I come home, is knowing that there's all of these people that I get to hang out with again who are really great and are, you know, going to be asking me about the projects that I'm working on and will be able to give me good ideas and just continue to be a sort of mutually encouraging um, group of people.